Barnes. Hello, I'm Oz Simpson. And, and this, this is Zebra, Zebra TV. TV. Welcome to 2017-2018 school year. Mission possible. We have one goal in Pine Bluff School District, one main goal, and that is outstanding academic achievement for all scholars, all means all. I don't care who the child is, where they come from, we mean all children. And ironically, as we're doing this video today, uh, today is convocation, but I'm wearing a t-shirt that says uh, no matter what their zip code is, what their, um, what the research says, their age, their socioeconomic status, their religion, or their race, it does not matter. Pine Bluff School District scholars matter. I am so excited to enter this new school year as your superintendent of schools. I'm Dr. Michael Robinson, and I wanna take the time because I know that I'm not gonna be able to see every parent and every child, every scholar, all of our community people, all of our teachers, but I again want to just say all of our employees, I just wanna say thank you uh, for working with me last year. I'm the first to tell you that many things were not perfect, but we're gonna work tirelessly uh, tiringly this year to make sure that we get it right and so I just on behalf of our Board of Education uh, my office uh, our officers uh, and all of central office we want to say welcome and thank you for allowing us the opportunity to educate our scholars collaboratively together have a wonderful and fantastic school as you can see, we are expecting great things here in the Pine Bluff School District. But one of the new things in the Pine Bluff School District is Charwell's food service. In the morning, they offer breakfast to us. We have waffles, parfaits, and cereal bars. Then at lunch, we have Philly cheese steaks, shrimp po' boy sandwiches, and pizza. We're gonna be eating good. We are off to a great start here in the Pine Bluff School District. We have the Kindergarten and First Grade Academy rolling at Southwood and the Broadmoor STEAM program. In addition, we have at the Jack Roby Junior High School and at Palm Bluff High School, we have the new Abbott program. Let's take a look at our superintendent as he tours our schools on the first day. Publicize academic success 
and student teacher achieves. And to inform the community on what's going on in Palmer School District. So Zebra fans, stay tuned. You don't want to miss an episode of Zebra TV. That's right. You don't want to miss not one episode on Zebra TV. And now, the organization featured for the week, the Paolo High School Zebra Marching Dark Cloud Band. What's up, y'all? I'm Mr. Timothy Scott, Director of Bands, Pomelo High School, Jack Roby. We're getting ready for an exciting marching band season with our 120 soldiers that we got. Uh, it's wartime. It's going down. We ready. How y'all doing? My name is Mr. Frederick Warren, Assistant Band Director over here at Palm Bluff High and Jack Roby. Like Mr. Scott said, we ready for war. We about to bring these soldiers, we about to bring the pain, and we about to bring it to the game. And now we walking ready. around. Uh, the kids said sex, look, we've been here since 6.30 this morning. We usually start on the football field. We work marching fundamentals, then we'll come to the parking lot uh, since the football team is practicing. Uh, we eat breakfast, probably around not, roughly 9.15. After breakfast, we go to sexual since this is the last week. There have been sexual until about 11 o'clock. As you can see, uh, you will hear the drums in the background. As you can hear, you will hear uh, snares, quads, bass drummers outside. Everyone else is broken down in the band room and classes, and they're working on everything from day one of camp to this point now. If, if you listen closely, you can hear the bass drummers working on individual section solos as well as snares. We got a new uh, Quint player. Learning from one of our veteran Quinn players. It's gonna be a good year from our award-winning drum line. Yeah, we're about to take a look at the at the French horn section at work. One of the most competitive sections in the band. These young ladies and, and gentlemen, they have what it takes to go far in this band world. As you can see, we're back in sexual. We're gonna go in. You hear them playing the alma mater now. That's a traditional song. If you don't know the traditional things, we don't play any of the things that they like to play and the things we like because we're big on tradition in the school and the band has a rich history. So as you can see, you got three, four, five, six, seven, it's eight. Eight French ones with a seven in here right now. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing the 2017-18 edition of the Palm Bluff High School Martin Zebra Band. Coming to a stadium near you, live and direct. See you in the fifth quarter. Go Zebras! As you can see from our cafeteria, to our many organizations, even to our academics, that we are expecting great things here in the Palm Bluff School District. For this mission is possible. And you're right, this mission is possible. Zebra fans, stay tuned for the next episode as we feature our Palm Bluff High School Cheer and Pump Squad. Until next time, later, later Z's. Z's.